in your oh. explanation of why we need estimates, you included the word visual or visualize. I can take that word many ways. Can you elaborate on what you intended? Sure, sure. So maybe let's uh, let's let's pull up uh, uh, one of the slides. I, uh, if we were to look at um, maybe jump ahead to slide eight. Yeah, exactly. So here's an example of um, we. So what we use is throughput, like how many items we finish within a time period. And typically we um, we look at these over the course of the week, right? And some, some teams could do two weeks, but you want to amplify um, feedback much more, much sooner. And so, and get, yeah. Anyway, so we look at how much effort or how many things we've gotten through the system in a week. And then uh, we're using the, Mon using the Monte Carlo, it gives us a graph. And it gives us a graph showing 85, 95, you know, even greater than 95%. And when we talk with clients or talk with teams and talk with teams, we talk in terms of with 85% likelihood, we will hit this date of October 14th. With 95% likelihood, we'll hit um, finishing these things. And these things are 100 items to be completed. That's, that, this is, that's the example here that we'll complete within, you know, by the, what is, what is that? It looks like the uh, 20th or something like that. Anyway, so yeah. it's great having that visual representation when talking with um, uh, leadership in an organization because they, the, the charts mean a lot. 